Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is how to straighten an image. And I just did a kind of a video. You could use rotation and you could rotate it, but it's sometimes a little difficult. So if you bring in a guy, I'm taking a picture of this block of wood I'm going to engrave on, and I'm going to bring the edge over, and you can see I'm a little bit off. I'm actually going to go down to this one. And that's right on the edge, and you can see there's a little bit of gap there, or at least I hope you can see that. But you can, if you're clicked on your image and you see your handles, you can go up to bitmaps and straighten image. It's going to come up with this green, and you can do a lot of things. One, we're going to change the lines to black, because I think it's easier seen. You can zoom in, just like you would in Corel, because you're still in Corel. But you can see where this line, and it dips down to that. So, and you can use your pan tool, and you can move these, move your image around a little bit till it gets closer to that line. So we got a gap right here. So now you can just, you need to uncheck crop image because we don't want to crop anything. And you want to rotate this way, so you want to move it this way just ever so slightly and that's way too much so let's let's put it back and a lot of times it's a lot easier just to do it with the numbers okay so we're at well, let's just put this on zero put it back to where it was so we need we've got a gap there let's let's just type in point one so we're going the opposite direction, so we need to point negative point 0.1. Not quite enough. Let's go negative 2, negative point, point 0.2. Not quite enough again. Negative, negative point 0.3. Let's go a little bit more now. Let's go negative point 0.9. See, we're too far now. Negative 0.5. And that looks pretty good. Your image is the same space. It's a minute more. We could go, you can play around with halves. Negative 5.5. Well, we did, I did wrong. Negative 0.55. And that looks really good. And then you need to go down here and put OK. Now our image, see it self-corrected itself? So you've got the same spacing. It's kind of hard to see in the picture. And you could play around with this even some more. But that way, when you show it to the customer, your, your text and your block will be the same. And it's, you're not going to use this block of wood for engraving, but you are going to use it for, you know, so I'm going to take this block and I'm going to draw a rectangle around that wood, and then I'm going to go out to the laser, and I'm going to test this to make sure that we're right. Anyway, so you have to have your item selected, and then go up to bitmap, and it's straighten item, or straighten image. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.